in just five minutes i will show you how to use wps on your smartphone in case you do not know what wps is you know wps is this free online application you can use to create written documents especially written documents on your smartphone in case you want to write an article maybe an ebook and you do not have a laptop you can use wps office to do that you know so i'll be showing you exactly how to use this application some of the tools you know you can use um it's almost like um you know using um a microsoft word so i just want to show you how you can use it on your smartphone but before i proceed with this tutorial please i want you to hit the subscribe button yeah i mean just subscribe it won't take you less than two seconds just do it right now just hit that button and also hit the thumbs up button and you can also drop a comment ask me any question you want i will answer your questions as soon as i see them so having said that i think i need to proceed with the tutorial so what you want to do is download this application on google play store if you're an android user but for iphone users i'm not sure if this application is available for iphone users but please if you use an iphone you can check if it's available if it's not available i'm sure there should be something close to wps office on apple store so you can try that but you know if you're using android uh, that's that's a big lock for you so just download the application and then you click it so on this application there's no need to sign up or anything like that once you download it just open it and then you would um <coughs> you sorry about that you say exactly this you know now now these are all the things i have written with this application uh so but when you open it this is the same interface you see but you won't see anything yet because you haven't written anything with the application so what you want to do is click on the plus sign and click on new document now before i proceed i want to show you something as you can see you can actually use this to create a spreadsheet and presentation and you can use it to write memo but i'm not um i'm going to teach you that right now i think in my next video i'm going to show you how you can use wps office to make a powerpoint presentation as well as you know spreadsheet and all that i'll be showing you exactly how to do that using wps office so once you click on new document you click on this blank page and then you get to this blank page so now this is where you write your content literally anything you want to write but um the reason i'm making this tutorial is to show you some of the basic tools you can use to format your work you know on on, on pixel lab you know some of the basic tools you can use so basically when you click on this tool this um icon that says tool this button you can see various options yeah is to save your work you want to print it you click on this if you want to export your work as pdf you click on this to export as pdf you know if you want to share you click on this you want to encrypt it you click on this just a whole lot of options um if you want to check your word count you click on this and um, you want to change the page background you click on this you want to do your page setup you click on this um, and all that but basically when you are writing these are some of the tools most of the tools you'll be using you know um, so for instance let me copy and paste the content here um, I'm coming okay let me post this let me say I'm going to post this So let me say here is our content this is basically just an example so um if you want to create a heading it's simple all you need to do is mark the test the text you want to use as a heading mark it highlight it click on tools click on paragraph uh, sorry click on fonts then bolding it increase the font size then click on paragraph and hide and position it here so your work is justified basically that's how you had a heading 
and same way you can add subheading to your text and if you want to add bullet points um let me say you want to add bullet points let me do this for instance although almost, Okay, so what you want to do is you know just write it that way and then you highlight all of them and you make them you click on this you know where you find all the bullets format and then you make your bullet points very easy and you can change the color of your text if you want maybe you want to make something um, um, um more noticeable like a keyword you can click on it then click on call this color any of these colors or you click on this to have the full color chart and yeah there you have it or you can add color to the background or the text like this there you have it so basically this is how wps works um you can even insert something into wps into your document you can insert shape your pictures or table so for instance you can even create hyperlink you know in your article so for instance you want to create um a picture you want to add a picture to your text what you want to do is Take the cursor to where you want to add the picture. Let me see here. Then you click on insert. Then you click on picture. And you click on you click on this. Let me see how to use um, this. Oh no, this is not so visible. Or let me put it that way so basically this is a picture I have put in I have inserted on uh, in our article of course you can also insert things like table let me see I want to insert a table I'll put the cursor where I want to insert the table I click on insert and I click on table and then I mark the number of table I want to insert like number of rows and columns let me say i just want four rows four columns i click ok and here yeah, i have it so this is really really simple but and interesting at the same time um there are so many other tools i might want to show you but maybe you don't have time for that but basically i've shown you the basic tools if you also have questions uh, concerning anything you can ask me and um, that's why you have the comment section so please use the comment section to ask me anything um thank you so much for staying with me in this video make sure you like and subscribe thanks a lot i'll see you in my next video